Okay, in looking at the Delight Collection, um, look number one, I love the simplicity of the classic um, Asian inspired cocktail dress. This is a real classic, it can be worn to a cocktail party. Um, and I think it's it's looks quite beautifully created. Um, Delight look number two. I love the illusion with the um, top mini skirt, very fun and flirty. And is look delight number three. Hold on, let me take a closer look at this. Oh, okay. Again, love the classic Asian inspiration, but the beautiful white fabric. This can almost even be worn as a wedding dress if you were doing something casual. Uh, let me get to look number four. Oh, I love this too. I love all the use of illusion in this collection. And okay, there we go. And again, bringing the illusion with the pearls into this look, just giving it a little bit more zhuzh. Um, let's see, go to delight look. Um, hold on. Let's go to number five. Yeah, five. This one has a real Marilyn Monroe feel to it. Very classic. Oh, but I like the high-low. That's fun. Oh, it's a two-piece. Okay, very interesting. So you could even take that skirt and wear that over a pair of leather trousers if you didn't want to do the full uh, leather dress or vegan leather, whatever that is. Very interesting, very feminine. Okay. Okay, one second. Um, Let's see here. Well, this has almost got like a militant inspiration to it, a military inspiration. I love the use of the black and white contrast. And beautiful combination. It looks like lace and again, illusion. Great, I love the continuity of the collection. Um, very well done. I think that's all, that's all the, the looks that she has. Let me just double check, I don't wanna miss anything. Okay. All right. Oh gosh, no, we've got more, sorry. Look number seven. A nice shift dress. Again, a good combination. Love the crispness of the black and the white and the lace and the illusion. Very, looks beautifully constructed. And the final look. Ooh, this looks fun. Love the puff sleeve, seeing tons of the puff sleeve in spring fashions. And the ruffle detail is interesting. 
with some embellishments. Let's see what else is I can film. Very fun. I don't know if this is a two piece or all in one, but it's, um, it's very interesting. And I like the short vest. Let's see, okay, now I'm gonna move on to enthusiasm. Let's see. Oh, this looks like a kid's collection. These are all really cute, really cute kids. Love the firefighter, junior firefighter. Okay, now moving on to anger. Oh, beautiful. These look like real uh, inspired cocktail dresses, great bright colors. Beautiful detail on these gowns. And I love the use of color. All the girls look happy in their dresses. And I like the um, variety of different sizes in the models. I think that's very current and very effective. Very, very pretty. Love all the blush tones. So anger makes me happy because this is a beautiful collection. I hope I'm doing this right. Um, Okay. Rebellion, ooh, okay. Okay, so this has got a real punk rock feel to it. I'm checking out all the looks. I like the inclusive again in the different shapes and sizes. Cohesive collection all have sort of an edgy punk rock feel. Oh, how can, oh, I love the flowers. That is such a good idea. That is so, that just gives a little bit of happiness to what we're going through. And these are all, we're gonna see all different kinds of masks like this. I even wanna use them for Fashion Week um, this year in October, if we hopefully can do it. And have, with your ticket, you will get a mask that says Fashion, FWR, Fashion Week Rochester. So these are clever. I would say my favorite though is the flowers, just, Everybody needs a little, little cheer right now. And um, these COVID masks are a huge part of our future. The bills, love the bills. All right, let's move on to sadness. Okay, Michael Crichton.
So we've got a lot of nice daytime fashion. The New Balance is the staple. So these look pretty much like cozy clothes we could be wearing right now. And again, all shapes and sizes, a nod to not just your size zero, which is very current. Okay, wait, let's see. Let's move on to the next one. Ooh, love the patchwork. These all look very well constructed. And it looks like I like the choice of fabrics because they look like they're soft and comfortable. And these looks look like they could be dressed up or worn with a pair of sneakers. Dejection. Okay. Ooh. I love this. I love that black coat. I like the white coat. Has almost like an Armani feel to it. The coat, the construction looks really good. I love those big pockets. Okay, we're gonna move on to Joy. Oh, just that picture is joyful. What a beautiful dress. So this seems like a bridal collection. Really pretty looks. I like the variety of straight, mermaid, covered, not covered. And the choice of where they're photographed is beautiful as well. Like particularly like the one with the open back and um, clearly the model is in a church. Okay. Euphoria. Oh, I love these, very feminine. Love the choice of fabric. Has sort of a retro feel to it, which I like. And I, in, I love this in look number Hydrangea. I love the uh, illusion sleeves. Very fun collection. And a lot of these look like they can be worn with under pieces or just as a jumper. So that gives it a nice versatility. Entranced. Oh, I love that fabric. So this has a European inspiration. Love the monochromatic suits. And I love the fabric of this final look. And again, I like the photography in the cemetery in a variety of different backdrops. Um, I think that's it. I think I've gone through everything. Um, I hope this was helpful and I look forward to anyone who wants to reach out to me for fashion week in October. I'd be, um, more than happy to feature your designs on the runway. Even if we do one look from each collection, uh, I know it's not been the best year. I have a senior in college as well, and she isn't even having a graduation. So I want to wish you all the best of luck and thank you for including me. And our website is fashionweekofrochester.org. So please check us out and feel free to reach out to me. Thank you. Bye-bye.